Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today I'm starting a new game. I'm starting Adam's Venture Origins. This is a game that I've already played once before. I don't remember a whole lot about it other than you play as a character named Adam. Uh, a woman by the name of Evelyn comes along with you and you're both on a journey to find the Garden of Eden. So I remember it being a really good game and I enjoyed it. I just for some reason don't remember a whole lot about it. So basically I wanted to give it a shot again and See if I is really as good as I remember. So let's hop into it and see how it goes. And I'm playing this on the Nintendo Switch. Oh, not what I wanted to do. No. I did not. I need to press new game. Ah, uh, there we go. Because that was the end. I was actually using that very end chapter because it's just a like one minute of talking and that's it. I was using that to test the audio. And it had quite a bit of chapters, but I don't think the chapters are that long. Adam? Adam! Wake up, boy. How can you sleep at a time like this? Come on, Dad. We're searching dusty old books at 2 a.m. in the morning. Uh, can't imagine why I dozed off. Exciting, isn't it? And what's more, I'm really onto something here. After all these years of research, I'm about to prove my Genesis theory. And if you do, we can stop reading? Wow. This is really exciting. Hmm? Well, in any case, I need you to find my new assistant in the library wing. There's a book there that I need. I do remember the guy being a bit of a smart ass. And let's see, what are the options? You want to turn that up a little bit. Brightness. Ooh, that might be a little bit too much sensitivity. Holy crap. Okay. Uh, and I can jump. That's good. Go down just one. That's still a bit too much. That seems a little bit better. Okay. We got here paintings, a bear, shield. Dominus Illuminatio Mea, the Lord is my light. Ironically chiseled above a fireplace. Yep. From Illuminati type stuff. Adam Venture makes the world go round. <laughs> that one never gets old, does it? <laughs> oh. oh, he's so weird. I love it. I do remember him having a nice booty. <laughs> I remember him and both the Avalon and the main characters. They both have nice booties. The father's assistant. I should look around a bit more. Oops. It's locked. A bunch of old men. General. Uh, you can run, you can jump. Hide. Well, I guess there's nothing to hide around. That's pretty. Pretty stained glass with some lines. In this hole, I remember this game having beautiful environments. I 
I should look around a bit more. Whoa. If this weather keeps holding, I'd better start building an ark. Oh yeah, I remember all the Bible references he make he jokes about. I just remember this game, it being, it reminded me a lot of like, uh, Indiana Jones. I love Indiana Jones movies. I think that's why I really enjoyed the game. I should look around a bit more. What's in here? Nothing. The old library might contain the book my dad needs, but where is his assistant? Ah, there she is. Excuse me, miss. I'm looking for my father's new assistant. Most likely a scruffy old fellow, a nerdy sort of type. Probably smelling like musty old books. Well, I'm Evelyn Appleby, your father's new assistant. You must be Adam. Am I the sort of type you're looking for? Yes. I mean, no. I, I mean... I, I only meant, uh... Oh, I think I know what you meant. Now, would you help me with these paintings? According to Professor Venture, they're the key to unlocking the library door. Why is the library door locked? It's in your own home, so why would you have a puzzle? It's locked. I know, I want to look at it's the puzzle. Locked. Okay. I don't know what I'm looking for if I don't I can't see the key or the lock. Oh. Okay. Let's see here. Oh, now we gotta go all the way back. All right, at least he's getting his exercise in. This is where I came from. What? Well, these are the pictures, but I don't see no shields above them. Was the gallery at the end of the hall? Maybe I need to go in there. I should look around a bit more. And that is locked. Okay. Then it's gotta be in here, this puzzle. I'm gonna say the general probably goes with the swords. He has a snake, so he probably goes with the medicine shield. He has the star and the moon. He might... Whoops. No. There we go. Lumen. Lumen. Latin light. for light. The enlightened ones. Ooh, ooh, uh, mushroom. Antelope. The young ones. How do I win this game? No game, Adam. 
These paintings represent five former faculty deans, known as the Enlightened Ones. The library contains their private collections. Lumen is the Latin word for light, so this must be a clue. You're not just saying that because I won, are you? Calm hey, down, dude. Not so fast. How is Lumen supposed to get us into the library? Wait for me. Seeing right. as you like games, why don't you crack the lock? Oh, I'll be more than happy to. Trust me. Oh, this is going to be one of those. Rotate ring A and Y. Okay. Oh, good God. <laughs> okay. Ow, that is a bit loud, that clicking noise. Oh, not what I wanted to do. A and Y. I need an E N. We got that side. I need L, fish, and then an E. That's every other one. Holy crap. Okay. So that does it one time. This does it every other time. Oh, I think I'm so close to you. It out. Yes, I did, Evelyn. I'm sorry so, to remember. Now that we're locked in the library, we might as well get that book. Which one is it? I thought you knew. Professor Venture just mumbled, it will be staring right at you, and kept on reading. Um, yeah, he tends to do that, I'm afraid. <sighs> We'd best start looking. I remember them having like a weird sexual attraction to each other, so there's constant smart asses to each other. Which is hilarious. It's also kind of remind me of a Tomb Raider. Except you can't shoot, I don't think. You can't do anything Find like a book that. that's staring right at you. Why is my dad always so cryptic? Staring right at you. I should look around a bit more. Huh. A book that's staring right at you. on the right path. Are you going to be able to climb that? Absolutely not. Because of course it's not going to be that easy. Uh, 
Okay, I see. Keep pressing the wrong damn button. That's what I thought. <laughs> To get it out of the way somehow. I, I, that, no, this ain't working. This ain't working. What is that sound? I think Evelyn's doing something. Oh my god, why does this have me so confused? Because I need to get this one. I need to get that one right here. I know now. Alright. Don't know why that was confusing me. not. Why would you have a book just thrown up on top of the shelf like this? Evelyn, look. I found the staring book. <laughs> you could say it just caught my eye. <laughs> it caught my eye? Seriously? That's right. I'm good looking and funny. What more can you want in a guy? Uh, right now, I just wish to find a way out of here. Oh. What do you know? I found a way. There we go. There we Add go. Adventure. Putting the vent into venture since 1901. Wow. <laughs> All his little jokes. He's just very full of himself. <coughs> Wait, what? How, how did you get out of there? It's called a door, Adam. You might want to try it sometimes. You just had to pull instead of push. Just warn me the next time you're gonna pull this on me, okay? She, she acted like she was stuck in that room and she needed us to find a way out. Seriously, Evelyn, come on. You know what? You actually smell a lot better than my dad's previous assistant. That's kind of, well, sweet, actually. And weird. <laughs> uh, let's keep going. 
I was like, what were you doing with Professor his previous Venture? assistant? Here's that book you've asked for. History of the Enlightened Ones, right? Ah, most excellent. Yes, that's right. And I see you've met my son as well. Splendid. Splendid. <clears throat> so, why did you need the book, Dad? The so-called Enlightened Ones found something. Something important. This book will reveal their secret. I'm telling you, son, this is it. Hey, what's the book say? Hey! Come on, son. Put it down. Ah, good. <laughs> now, let us read. I, I can't read it, too? Use book. How do I use the book? All I do is snatch it from him. Huh. Slowly, put the book down. No one um, needs to be hurt. Give it back, Adam. What if I just I throw it in the fire? Kidding. Okay, that worked. Whoa! Uh, I did not mean to do that. All I saw was a prompt, and I just did it. <laughs> oh well. A.V. Adam Venture. Oh shit, I'm dead. Fantastic. Come uh, on, get up. Am I? Ah, man, that hurts. Dad? Dad? Evelyn? Can I call you Evelyn? Hmm. Guess not. I mean, surely you couldn't have fallen that far where they can't hear you screaming. Otherwise, you'd be dead. Oh, and he has a lasso, I think, too. Right. I can jump to my death or pick up that grappling hook back there. Uh, what happens if I just jump to my death? <laughs> oh, I gotta load the checkpoint. Wow, they really was like, oh no, once you step off, that's it. We aren't doing any further animations. You're gone. Wow, where am I? Ah, man, that hurts. Dad? Dad? Evelyn? Can I call you Evelyn? Hmm, guess not. Just what I was looking for. Grappling hook. Fine swing. Okay. Not a lasso, but a grappling hook. Still, very similar. Fantastic. Okay. Might as well start looking for this mysterious secret. Or better yet, a way out. Alright, we're good. There we go. And it just so happens the wood is still in good condition. And did not break from the fall. All rats. Oh, I did not need to jump down that way. It seems the Enlightened Ones were also free-time Masons. Quite a thing they've built down here. Um, yeah, they need to have a substantial workforce to build this.
Okay. I was about to say, do we ju just jump to this chain and then slide down? But that is a no. That would have been bad. He has a book and a sword. The other one does not. That looks like an elevator or a lift. That obviously goes farther. Illuminatio Mia. Okay. Let's not pull that just yet. We have some planets hmm. here. Something's missing. Solar system. Don't know what country that is. It looks like a country. Also looks like a country. The Earth. Europe. So one of these must be a country and another one like a territory. But that's got to be like a territory or a province. This is incredible. Beyond imagining. Unbelievable. My dad was... Right? Oh, and this room's pretty amazing as well. Okay. Find the missing pieces. And Europe is in red. I should look around a bit more. Let's go back out. See what opened up. Where did I get a torch from? I guess I've just been carrying it with me. Huh. These trinkets seem quite useful. One of four. Okay. I feel like I'm getting into an area where... Ooh, exactly that. Exactly. Oh. I was going to get to the point where I could actually swing and fall off and die. How far are you going to put me back? Right here, okay, that is good. All right, pull the torch out of your ass, you know, because I don't know where you're getting it from.
Ooh, okay. I almost missed that. I almost missed it. Nothing over here. Okay. We made it. Fantastic. This place is freaking huge. There's a trinket right here. I messed up. Well, oh, damn it. Is it going to put me back with the lion? It did. Fantastic. Okay. Let's swing from this way. No! Why did he not pick up speed? Every other time he swung, he went really fast, but not that time. Ah. Oh. attempt whatever I don't even know how many times this is see why did he swing so freaking fast there but that one you're barely barely swinging dude come on another priceless piece for my ever-growing collection no don't go too far All right. Why can't you see that one? There you go. God, he swung, swung so far. Four of these round discs. Soon they'll have me playing checkers down here. Fantastic. Now we've got four pieces. Come on. How do you jump again? <laughs> oh, come on. Seriously? How do you jump? Do not. Oh, my God, dude. Seriously? There we go. Oh, how convenient. Right back where we started. I'm supposed to be putting them in at a certain order. Well, I'm about to see. I may have put him in wrong. This. 
this. I've got to tell my dad. Okay. I figured you had to put him in at a certain order, but I guess not. Drought de Luz, 1925. The weather's nice. Look at those trees. They're nice, too. Yeah, everything's nice. Yeah, I don't know a whole lot about Europe and the different areas. I don't know that, how do you say those names? So, you're absolutely sure we're on the road to lose this time? Lose? Of course I am. I can read a map like a... a book. My point exactly. You're not quite like your dad, are you? Which is why he sends me to do his field work. Now, let's go see what this holdup's all about. You know who he, he reminds me of? Uh, I'm a huge Stargate fan. So I love, uh, Colonel Excuse Jack O'Neill. We'd like to go to Luz and... But a problem. A mechanician will be here to fix my car in... Three hours or so. Three hours? But what about your mail? Just a package for that crazy professor who's studying our town. Far the problem. Um, would you be willing to take us there? Once my car's fixed? For the problem. Yeah, the way Adam acts, he acts like Jack O'Neill. Like, he acts like a smartass, acts like he isn't very intelligent, but in reality, he's actually quite intelligent. That's who he reminds me of. Fragile. To fix this, I'd need a wrench. A wrench. You wouldn't happen to have a wrench now, would you? Uh, the problem. I know. Thanks anyway. Of course, you don't have a wrench. So, why do you want to visit our professor? Well, it all began when Adam found a secret room. Uh, are you hitting, hitting on Oxford, my woman? Pointing us to this You place. need to quit it. Oh, she Isn't is it? mine. So anyway... There's supposed to be a connection between Luz and the Book of Genesis. Perhaps this professor will know more. It's all ever so exciting. All right, you two chat. Here, little birdie. Oh, Miss Appleby, you love the what? birds as well. We have so much in common. Hey, watch it. Where can I find a wrench? We don't have a trunk or anything. I can't jump over that way. I can't go any further that way, okay? Where is there a wrench just laying around? I mean, he had a torch up his ass, so why doesn't he have a wrench? Seriously. And I can't talk to either of you. This is so baffling. You want a wrench? I can't go inside. can't jump on anything. I somehow had the wrench. I don't understand. Where did I get the wrench? Okay. 
time. That one is good. None of that lines up with that. Well, there's actually several that match with this. just had it too. No, I did not. There we go. Merci bien, monsieur. I will deliver my package now. See, I told you. That was a stupid puzzle for a car engine. That made no sense how the wires could just change up and break down like that. There we go. I think this postman's got a fake accent. Can we trust him? You think he's got a fake accent? Okay. Come on. It's loading. I've got it covered up in the screen. I forgot to check that. My camera placement. I need to pay better attention to the bottom right hand corner. We have arrived. Welcome to the beautiful town of Lourdes, known for its lovely, um, known for its, um, well, you know what I mean. No, we do not. Okay, what are we doing here, Evelyn? Are you gonna talk to me? Fragile. Is that our package? Hey, you down there. Hello, I'm Adam Vet. Yes, yes, get that package up here, boy. You're late. Hey? The grumpy old geezer didn't even hear me out. Said he wants his crate delivered to the roof. Well, I just got it out of the truck. So it's time for a break. Union rules. Seriously? Oh, never mind. Let's just deliver the crate ourselves. We might yet learn something from this professor. Sure, like how to be rude. But mm -hmm. fine, I'll deliver the stupid crate. Ah, uh, that's hilarious. Look, dude, can I tip you or um, something? A little help here? The crate looks a bit too heavy for me, but you're doing a great job, Adam. <laughs> You know, Evelyn, I think you would make a great postman. Really? I'm expected to do it by myself. Seriously? Dude, you could at least help me out. You know, let's go a lot quicker. Especially after I fixed your car on the side of the road for free. this oh, I need to get it to the red so it's at 12 and I need to get it to 27 I, I need to write something down okay so 27 is the goal right now I'm at 12 Give me to 24. So if I do 12 and 3. Ah, okay, got the ladder down. And Evelyn, she didn't even thank me, she just took off. At last, the final parts. Well, are you expecting a tip, boy? Get off my roof. Me? What? Get off your roof? 
I'm Adam Bencher. Danger trembles when it hears my name. I- Oh my god, Adam, dude. Shh. Um, my companion here is trying to say that we share your interest in Luz. Do you? Why? What do you know? Hmm. I could. How about you fix the rest of my windmills? Then we'll talk. Okay, so fix the windmills. Let's just go along with it, Adam. Twirling windmills might cheer him up. I know. You see, all men are like children. That's just not fair. I'll tell my dad you said that. Right. Well, if you take this side, I'll go there. You're, you're actually going to do one? I figure you're going to leave it all to me. At least she's helping for once. Best leave her to it. Oh, I was thinking just the same thing, Adam. So the end goal is 13. Uh, okay, I need nine here. So that's one, two, three, four. So I can go down. Okay, so nine to 13. Uh, if I go this way, it's 16, 14. Hmm. 11 and 12, that ain't gonna do it. Right across. 14, 18. 16, 15, 14, that's back to 15. That's 14, 18. That'd be down to 13. All right, no. Let's see, 14, 13, 13, 11. That'd be 14. Thirteen, twelve. There we go. Where's the next one? Right here. That's cool. really doing is covering up here we go just the instructions but right. Ooh, you almost ran off Adam fill out I don't like it cuz it's not all the way in the corner Oh well, that, that'll just have to do with the camera. All right. So we need to get the one. Oh, damn. God damn, come on. I don't know if anyone else's switch does this, but the D-pad, this right here, messes up. And I've tried multiple controllers, and I actually think it's a switch problem. So two, five, no. So if we go four, three, four, three, two, seriously? So four, three, four, three, Two. Okay, that's the wrong way. Two. 
four. Here we go. 21 from one. We have five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Fifteen. Yeah, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. And the twelve. Thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen. 20, 21, 22. Okay. 5, 6, 12, 13, 14, 15. Twelve. 13, 14. 17, 18, 19, 20. Okay, let's back up here. One, two, three, four. Down to one. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 21. Oh, that just did the same thing. Okay. Oh, there's a little thing to the side that shows how much. Okay. I did not realize I was there. Yeah, I can't use this one. Because it just blocks it off. So that point plus one over there is pointless. Gives me one too much if I do this. Oh, no, not what I wanted to do. Oh, are you joking me right now? Oh, it messed me up. All right. Four, three. Four. Four, three, four, three, two, two, four. Okay. It's this one I'm having a struggling with.
Oh, god damn it, dude. Alright. Twenty two. How do I lose one? Doesn't do it either. That still gives me twenty two. So I need to do like all of them except the plus two. So how can I leave plus two out? Pad is irritating me. Let's try working backwards, shall we? So 21 plus 2 is 23. 20. No, 19. Technology there we is go. scaring off the birds. Typical. Alright. Uh, 
okay. Was that it? Just two? I should look around a bit more. I could swear there's more than that. Right? Why do you want those windmills fixed anyway? Yeah. For my experiment! It's going to be a wonder of invention. You'll see. You'll see. I can't jump back up there. Fantastic. I did need to go this way. Adam, would you mind giving me a hand? I can't seem to fix my last windmill. <sighs> yeah, yeah. Let me get over there. Just don't ever call me stupid again. And I need eight. That's going to take away four. Yeah. Then fourteen. me a 13. Thirteen. Sixteen, fifteen. I subtracted way too much. That was easy. Oh, did you figure it out? Yes, I did. You couldn't. So, quit being a smart ass. Uh, excuse me. I should look around a bit more. Wow. Okay. You take the easy path, and then I gotta take the hard path. Woo! Damn it. Oh, please don't make me do those puzzles again. I don't know where that grapple was trying to take me. Okay, she went down there. There we go. Oh, then we can open this door. Wait, 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 wait. I want to look at something. This. Knights Templar. Okay. So is he a knight? That works. That works. A triumph for science. No, a triumph for me. Finally, I'll be able to enjoy a decent cup of coffee in this barbaric town. And just the right strength with a splash of something. 
I'm putting the camera back over here. And it's covering up their names. And the controls really are the only ones that show in that corner, and that's not really important. Have you found a way yet? A way to what? I don't understand what I'm supposed to be doing. Can I go down this way? There we go. Come on. The little loading thing is behind my camera. There we go. Templar Church. Okay. Professor Santomer, um, why are you researching this town? Laws and its church in particular are of interest to the company that's funding my research. I'm not at liberty to discuss it. Oh, come on. Not even after our contribution to your, um, scientific revolution? Hmm. Scientific progress does taste rather good, and my research is absolutely stuck anyway. You know what? Fire up the projector and I'll tell you what I don't know. Oh, great. Another puzzle. Why is everything broken? Oh, okay. I see. That's good. Okay. That's good. That's good, so it's just one right here. <clears throat> uh, my work here is supported by a powerful organization called the Clairvaux Corporation. Years ago, this company acquired the memoirs of Charles Leroux, a knight who joined the Third Crusade with Richard Lionheart. Historical records show that after the Crusades, Charles ended up here in Luz, claiming to have unlocked a secret to Genesis. However, even if this exists, he took it to the grave. A grave I have been unable to find in over a decade. Professor, excuse me for asking, but where have you been looking? Charles was a member of the Templar Order, so I've been assuming he was buried at the nearby Templar Church. Take you there. Follow me. Okay, we're gonna go grave robbing. Sounds good. Sounds fun, Evelyn. That's quite a storm. That storm is barely raining. Although it's probably not the best time to go grave digging in a storm. I guess it'll make the ground softer, but. Therefore, my current theory about Charles' mm. grave is based upon the dates on these gravestones. First, you take the date of birth on this one, then add it to the death on that one, and subtract that from the first number on this one. Then, if you divide this by the number of tombstones and take the last three digits of that, you get quite a significant number. Remember it! Now add 42 to the length of that guy's name. Oh, no. Hey, that can't be the puzzle. Why can't I examine this one? I'm pressing X. Robert de Crayon. Hmm. Interesting. Oh, it just lights it up. Uh, Jonathan? Hey. Okay. Go on. 
got Audrey. Okay. I should look around a bit more. Okay. There's a bell sequence. Uh Okay. Wonder if they're all supposed to face each other. Where are you facing? Why are you facing the tree? Okay. She turns very little. Okay. Which way does he turn? facing each other but that didn't do anything I should look around a bit more Constance Elvir of something can't read the last part Can't read either of those. Oh, these have stayed lit. Maybe those don't need to be lit. But what do those dates mean to me? 1184. 1083. Oh, what is this? Problem is, I cannot read sheet music. I don't understand. Five notes. I'm gonna try something, but I think it's wrong. It's the problem is, I can't. I can't read sheet music, and I don't know anything about music theory or notes, nothing of that nature. Try something. I did not do it. Low to high, okay. Okay, that did nothing for me. How did I solve this last time? I should look around a bit more.
Damien. The professor's theory is interesting, but quite wrong. These statues are much more significant. How so? Tell Not me, now, Evelyn. Adam. I'm trying to figure this out. Ah. Hey, Evelyn. Am I just gonna have to brute force this? That's what we're going to do. Come on. Oh, damn it. I'm messing this up bad. Surely they would have to be like facing each other, right? This one faced that one. Kind of. Not really, though. Spin around way too much. I was rather looking out in the graveyard, looking at the tree, or you're looking at her. Not now, Adam. I'm trying to figure this out. You're in the way, please, Evelyn. And you spin way too much. Do you need to look behind you? Okay. Constance. Let's turn them all off. And then we can look. Constance. Elvir. Damien. Robert. Hey, none of the names are repeating. 1333, 18. Are the dates just a red herring? these bells. I know it's something with this, but I don't know what that is. K9. 
cannot interact with it. Well, this sucks. I wish there was more clues. I mean, could you give me a Not clue? Not now, Adam. I'm trying to figure this out. I, I'm trying to figure it out too, and you aren't helping me. They all got their backs turned. I didn't do nothing. Let's attempt to brute force this, shall we? How did I do this before? I don't, I do not remember this puzzle. This is so slow to turn. Damn. And I think it's Evelyn. She keeps getting in the way, causing a problem. Go away, Evelyn. This ain't doing it. Oh, I'll probably have to look this up because I really don't know. I'm not understanding it. I don't see anything with these dates that make any sense. Like, this one is pointing to that one. You can turn multiple ways. Point one over there. Hmm. I mean, they're all pointing to the same gray. Constants.
All right. I looked it up. And I was right. It's the damn bells. And I could have swore I'd already done this. Oh, bell. One. Four. Oh my god. This. This. this I guess I just did this. not do it slow enough. Okay. What is that mm. sound? Interesting. I should look around a bit more. Oh, right here, where's Sir Flame? Now I gotta pick up a torch. How did I get one the first time? should look around a bit more. And you're not going to try to open the door? I mean, I get it. You don't want Evelyn and the other guy bothering you. It's locked. It's locked. There's a bunch of chests. Why don't you open them up and try to find some treasure? This. Something on that statue. Okay, that opens the door. Source of the four rivers from the Book of Genesis, the location of paradise. The Clairvaux Corporation will mount an expedition immediately. Hold on. Look at this note. And the Lord God said, The man has now become like one of us, knowing good and evil. He must not be allowed to reach out his hand and take also from the tree of life and eat and live forever. Clearly, this must be a warning. Warning or no warning. This discovery is too lucrative, um, I mean too important to neglect. I agree. Finding this scroll mm -hmm. was surely meant to be. Besides, I've never run away from danger before, and I promise to keep you safe. Okay. Looks like that chapter's over with. Which is so irritating, because I tried that combination on the bells and they didn't work. I guess I just went too fast. Gate of Eden. All right, I'm going to end that here for today. We'll pick it up next time with the Gate of Eden. So thanks for joining me, and I will see you next time.